this is a really easy project that you could make using any Arduino board, and you only need a few components as well, which I've listed in the description. The actual tower here is just two servos that have been taped together, and the wiring is really easy too. Uh, you could pause the video here, or you could check the description where I'll provide a link to the diagram. Basically, you just have a laser attached to one pin and the two servos attached to two other pins. And all this is controlled from an app called Blink, uh, which allows you to create a user interface for your Arduino and have it link over your Wi-Fi. Now, you could set up the app in any way you want, but if you don't want to have to make any modifications to the code, all you have to do is set it up in the way that I've done it here. All it is is a joystick to control the servos, a button to turn the laser on and off, and another button that puts it into automatic mode. The settings for all the individual components of the interface are shown here as well, but again you can check the description to see them in more detail. So I put all of the circuitry into a yoghurt pot, uh, because I wanted it to be a little bit more discreet. Also, I know nobody cares about the code, but for the few of you that are interested, it's fully annotated, so you can see that in the description if you're interested in how it works. You can see here I used the laser uh, as a guide so that I knew where to cut out the hole. It's also worth noting that my laser plugs into a laptop uh, because that was just the most convenient way for me to do it but you could just as easily make it run from a battery uh, and not have it plug into anything at all. And you'll see here that the control of the laser is actually quite precise and quite responsive too. And once you finish with it nobody will be able to tell what it is. So I know that this video might have been a bit fast for some people, uh, but if that's the case you just need to go into the description and there'll be a link to the full instructions uh, if you need a little bit of extra help. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, you could consider subscribing to this channel uh, for more content coming up soon. So thank you for watching and good luck if you decide to try this project for yourself.